I'm Shelby with the Athens Library, and today I'm going to be reading Trouble by Catherine Battersby. Our new neighbor turned up one day without warning. I don't know where he came from, but I knew just by looking at him. He was trouble. Chamomile and I had seen his type before. We could hear him through our shared wall. Bang, bang. He was a wild animal. Growl, smash. He had terrible teeth and knife-like claws and huge, horrifying hungers. Trouble was not to be trusted. Trouble wore strange clothes and did strange things. I just ignored him. But it wasn't long before trouble came knocking. I knew he was up to no good. Trouble lurked around every corner. That's when something horrible happened. Trouble attacked. Now I was the wild animal. I had to protect chamomile. But trouble followed close behind. Nowhere was safe. So I stacked up and packed up and was ready to leave for good. But... Chamomile. Next door, trouble was up to something suspicious. And then I heard... Meow. Trouble had chamomile! He was going to eat her! He would gnash his terrible teeth and slash his knife-like claws and fill his huge, horrifying hunger. I burst in, ready for trouble. Bang. Meow. And that's when I realized he wasn't trouble. I was. I wanted to say sorry, but I didn't know how, so instead I said, do you drink tea? Well, it turns out that tea and cookies are the perfect pair. Each may be different. But somehow they make the other better, and suddenly you can't imagine life any other way. Could I trouble you for some tea? 
no trouble at all. The end. This has been Trouble by Catherine Battersby.